my diamond art friends, Eileen here. How is everybody doing on this terrific Tuesday? It is Tuesday, July 2nd, and I am going to come to you, or I am coming to you, <laughs> good grief, with my, um, I guess, June in review. I want to show the canvases that I completed in the month of June and the one whip that I'm carrying on over into July. Super excited to bring that to you. But I first want to say, if you are new here, welcome. And if you are returning, thank you for your continued support and friendship. I'm so glad you're here. And thank you for spending some part of your day or night with me. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first canvas that I completed in the month of June was for dark and creepy diamond paintings and um, true vampire crafts. They each did um, events. Dark and creepy diamond painting did a food event and true Van vampire crafts was doing an animal event. It was kind enough to allow um, the canvases that we had, if they were food, like animal related, to um, also be part of her event. So the first canvas that I did was, let me bring it back just a hair, is this canvas of chicken and, and fries. I named it Chicken and Fries. It is from AliExpress. It was 24 colors. And it was an absolute hoot to do. I started it on June 1st and completed it on June 6th. It had plenty of drills, decent stick. It was a really, really fun canvas. I didn't add anything special to this one. And I kind of like it. I just, it just looks so, I don't know. It looks delicious. So I'm really not sure what I'm going to do with this one. I sealed it and I am likely either going to get it dry mounted, you know, just to kind of have. But right now I think it's going to go in my portfolio until I figure that part out. Okay, so the second canvas that I completed was this canvas right here. I got this canvas from Timu. I named this canvas Cujo after my puppy nephew, Cujo Hemingway. He happens to be an old dog now, but he is the best puppy nephew this gal has ever had. And I really liked this one. It was 24 colors, which included two ABs. I didn't add anything special to this canvas. It was a round drill. And I did complete this for, again, Dark and Creepy Diamond Paintings Food Event and True Vampire Crafts Animal Event. I think this came out darling. I am definitely getting this framed and I'm um, displaying in my home because it does remind me of my, of Cujo, my puppy nephew who happens to have lived now in New York for two years with my sister and I miss him. He is just the best dog ever. Okay, so let's see here. Let me flip this over. And then the next canvas that I completed in the month of June was this heart canvas. And it was completed for Mushies or Dark and Creepy Diamond Paintings Food Event. It was 18 colors, but within those 18 colors, I did add nine different ABs in those colors. So what I do when I add my ABs are, um, is I put, I have the drill color or the drills of that aren't ABs and this AB that is either the same or quite similar. I pour some of those ABs in the, in the container and do a shake, 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 how they fall on my pen when I pour them is how it, um, you know, appears, you know, on the canvas. So I will say I did have some issues with the stick and right here there was basically no stick. And so you'll see when I seal it, there's a little bit of grossness there, but that's okay. Um, I did start this one on June 8th and completed it on June 13th. And I do want to mention, which I didn't, 
for Cujo. I started that on June 6th and completed it on June 11th. But this one otherwise was very enjoyable. And because this one was enjoyable and I kind of liked how it turned out, I did go ahead and purchase some more heart canvases. And lucky for me and the rest of you who may be interested in purchasing canvases such as these, I do believe Dark and Creepy Diamond Painting in the month of September will be doing a event with hearts. So that is this canvas right here. So this was finish number three. Okay. Finish number four was, let me flip it over. I do believe. Let me just make sure. Yes, it was. Canvas number four was this canvas, which I also did for uh, the animal and food events. I called this one turtle soup. It was 24 colors. I did add within those colors seven ABs from my stash and two shimmer drills. Purchased from Timu. It was a joy to do. It's really cute. I liked it a lot. Um, let me see. Uh, started it on June 15th and completed it on June 20th. Super, super cute little canvas, really easy to get done. As you can see, lots and lots of color blocking and um, oh, lots of color. Okay, let me see here. I just need to check on the dates on the other one. I can't remember which one I finished first and which one I finished second. Six twenty six. Okay, so the next one I'm going to show, I did a review on it um, already, so I'm not going to go too much in depth about it. I did complete uh, this hollow, what was listed on um, this company's site as a Halloween girl. I named her Bootyful Ballerina. I did run out of three drill colors. I did email the company. They did not respond to me. And it's been over a week and I still haven't received a response. Um, started this on May 27th and finished it on June 26th. I do like that the image rendered well, but really can't recommend uh, this, this canvas, or even to say it was enjoyable since I ran out of three drills with no response. So this is all I'm going to say, even though I probably mentioned it in my review video about this canvas. Simply um, running out of drills is why people save like their spare drills. For those of you that say, why would you, why would you save your spare drills when you're finished with the canvas? Well, this is why. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm keeping it. I've already sealed it. Um, as I said, it came out nice. Thank goodness for my stash of spare drills. And the last completion that I had for the month of June, let me get to my page, is Cowboy Anthem. Let me lower this down just a little bit. This is from Raven Diamond Art. It is a 30 by 40. It was 40 colors with two ABs. This one I didn't, was a kit that I received in a random act of kindness from a, another customer at Raven Diamond Art, which I got with my two purchases ago uh, in that um, when I received the canvas that I bought and it was absolutely a pleasure to do. I love how it came out. Perfect for um, Independence Day coming up for us here in the United States. I did start this on June 16th and I completed it on June 27th and it is absolutely gorgeous um, and I really liked it a lot. And the whip or the whip or 
or work in progress, good grief, Eileen, that I am carrying over into the month of July and is currently on hold uh, while I work on the canvas that I started yesterday is this Harley and Joker canvas. I got this in a PR package from Diamond Art Decor. It uh, has, um, it includes four ABs, but I have added three fairy dust drills. I did start this at the end of June, so 628, and I will be going back to this canvas as soon as the one that I started yesterday is done. Um, yeah, I, I love Harley and Joker, as I've mentioned, and so far I'm loving everything about this canvas. I'll be honest, I just wish that I had more ABs um, for certain colors that I don't have to have added, but I mean, four ABs that are already included in the canvas, and then, um, you know, adding three fairy dust, I think maybe that's plenty, but I really like to bling stuff out. Um, so I'm going to be putting this one back, you know, underneath the bed while I wait to finish. But as I said, it's coming out lovely. Love it. Love it. Love it. It is a round drill. Um, enjoying this one very much and was kind of like hesitant to put it away. But I'm like, come on. It's fine. You can finish it up. Please expect a review video on this canvas since it was a PR package so that I can kind of give them absolute credit for uh, this canvas and let you know what my experience was with it. So that is my video of my June completions and the one work in progress that I took over into July. So please like and comment and have yourself a nice day or night, whatever it is for you. Take care. Happy diamond painting. And until my next video, bye.